The Ryder Cup is swinging into Sheboygan next week, and small businesses are preparing for what could be a huge week for them. Local 5's Barrett Tryon shows us their last-minute preparations. This is the only place in the country where you can buy every type of Johnsonville sausage that we make and sell in the U.S. If you're looking for a little sausage swag, look no further than across the street from the global headquarters for Johnsonville. The company is hoping to take a bite out of all the extra visitors during Ryder Cup week. From Sheboygan, we have Barron's Gelato here. We have Palermo's Pizza. Um, so we're just really proud to show a lot of the Wisconsin foods here in addition to all the Johnsonville sausages. Ten minutes away, it is all about the grapes. The Blind Horse Restaurant and Winery has been waiting for this moment for more than two years. Last year's cancellation was a shock, uh, but I have to tell you, we're, I've never seen what is happening to this county of, of what's happening this week. General Manager Tom Nye says he's been booked for weeks. I think it's going to be a shock to a lot of people, actually, to be honest with you. But yeah, it's, this is kind of unprecedented for our area. On any given day, about 47,000 people call Sheboygan home. Well, during the Ryder Cup, that population is expected to double in size. There's one restaurant in town. That knows a thing or two about golf. Luigi's restaurant had a famous visit from Tiger Woods in 2004 when he was in town for a PGA championship. I think we're all like really anxious and anticipating a lot of business, and also really excited for that. From meatballs to golf balls, it will be a busy week for many. We're just excited to see all the people and the introduce Sheboygan County to people that have never heard of us before. In Sheboygan, Barrett Tryon, Local 5 News. Our live coverage begins next week. Barrett will be there covering everything you need to know about the big golf match beginning Monday afternoon at 4.